Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Ujai, I'm your host, Salas. We are here to talk today about Daniel Kofitra. He set for a move to side Freiburg. Yes, uh, you know Daniel Kofitra had an amazing season uh, with his club uh, in St. Pauli. Uh, he scored uh, 12 goals, uh, provided 8 assists, and uh, he has been on the market. And he is someone of interest to top clubs in Europe. Uh, in transfer news, riddled with a lot of rumors about where the player is going to something concrete has come in we're going to discuss it today we're also going to talk about the ghana football awards yes the can subscribe if you have not I click on the notification bell to get more updates daniel kofitre had to leave the ghana black stars camp to sort out his future that's what uh, the communications director of the ghana football association henry asante Jum said and Owing to that, uh, he had to leave the camp and not take part in the Karen Cup. Yes, Karen Cup competition with the Black Stars finished third. In light of that, Kofi Tre went out uh, to sort out his future. And the reports making the rounds are that he has settled on a particular team. According to the rumors, as the transfer news are making the right. Freiburg have won the race uh, to sign in demand Ghana midfielder Daniel Kofi Tre. Atre has agreed terms with the Bundesliga club and the deal is set to be completed this week. Now, Freiburg are beating German and Turkish clubs uh, to the signature of Atre, who was outstanding in the just ended season. Now, the report says that Freiburg have met both St. Pauli and Atre's financial demands in order for the transaction to be completed. Uh, St. Pauli are said to have asked for around 4.5 million euros for Atre. Initially, Trey was expected to join Weather Bremen, uh, but the club withdrew their interest with Clem Clemens Fritz, uh, their head of scouting and professional football, expressing regret. Uh, we had good discussions and a really good exchange, said the 41 year old. I didn't think the decision was easy for him either. In the end, he chose a different path, which is really a shame. Sometimes uh, that's how it is in football. Also, there was interest from Besiktas and Bundesliga outfit Mainz 05. A trade you had the attention of all these clubs after scoring 12 goals and providing 8 assists in the just ended Bundesliga season. So it looks like Daniel Kofitre will be joining uh, Freiburg in the Bundesliga next season. Wish him all the very best. Kofitre, unfortunately, uh, to me, my, I didn't really enjoy him uh, during the international break. He had issues with he's staying fit and all that so probably did not see much of him for the Ghana national team did not see that side of his football in the Central African Republic game is when he played not so great on that front but uh, it was just after the season had ended probably fatigue from games being played for a very long time in the season so we'll see what happens on that front when the deal is finalized uh, personal terms are agreed with Freiburg great move for him let me know your thoughts in the comments box my next story has to do uh, with uh, the Ghana Football Awards, which is set to take place on the 2nd of July. The nominees were named on the 17th of June over the weekend, and three Ghanaian players who play their trade in the English Premier League have been nominated for the flagship prize in this year's Ghana Football Awards. And now it was revealed during the nominees' announcement that uh, deputy Ghana captain and Arsenal star Thomas Partey, Daniel Amati of Leicester City and Sally Su are three of the five players shortlisted for the Ghana Footballer of the Year category this term. And the other two are French based Alexander Juku and Jojo Alacot who plays in the English lower division. The five players will battle it out to be crowned Ghana Footballer of the Year uh, with the winner succeeding Andrea who won the award last year. Ghana Football Award scheme which has become uh, the most coveted in recent times in football space celebrates footballers who have done great exploits within the year under review. These players are celebrated in grandeur style at the Football Awards which comes off every July. This CES event uh, will take place at the Grand Arena of the Accra International Conference Center on Saturday July 2nd 2022 with the Footballer of the Year, the icing of, of Ghana Black Stars player Daniel Kofitre. He is set to join Freiburg next season as he sorts out his future. He left the Black Stars camp to do as much 
and he's almost done sorting out his future semi-final clash uh, for the games uh, that is going to happen in the WAF 1 17 2 has been said Ghana will take on Burkina Faso also Nigeria will take on Ivory Coast in a super weight clash in the under 17 it will be interesting to watch we'll be at the Cape Coast Sports Stadium to bring you everything you need to know on that front as well so I'll see you guys in the next one have a great week Hi, I'm Derek Wati, former Blaster football player. Uh, on the 2nd July, come and let's watch Ghana Football Awards in the arena.